We've arrived at the Otter Creek Campground off of the Blue Ridge Parkway in Virginia. You can hear them cutting grass behind me. So I'm wondering if they're gonna be opening this campground up soon. U.S. fee area, it says $20 per site. Be half that with a access pass. Let's take a look around, check it out. Pretty looking creek. Yeah, sure is pretty looking creek. Here's another view of the creek. Some campsites up there we'll take a look at in a little bit. Motor homes, trailers to the left. Tents, vans, pickup campers to the right. Let's go to the right first. Okay. This is the uh, tent camping truck camper loop. Just talked to a volunteer. She said they are closed due to COVID. Uh, and while they're closed, they're making improvements to the campground. So that, that's what's going on here. So let me get, take you on a short tour through the uh, both loops of the campground. And here's site eight. It's a typical site. A place to park your car, or Jeep, pick the table, a tent pad, and then a fire ring over here see another one up there continue around the loop give you a short tour do you have trash receptacles uh, in the campground B13 uh, looks like a nice spot it's actually a down by the creek here Yeah. Yeah, nice looking creek. There's your picnic table and fire ring and tent pad. And uh, here's your parking area to the left. And then to the right, I believe that's the parking area for. 14 right there. This is site 14. There's the creek. Another Creekside campsite. There's your tent pad, parking is right there. We'll go back and see what site number it is here in a minute. Then you have the creek right here in your backyard. That was site B17 we were just looking at. There's your uh, parking pad, firing a picnic table back there by the creek.
continue around the loop, see what else we got. Site B28, it's got some privacy. Wonder if we're gonna leave all this firewood stacked up. Looks like they have a campfire circle on this loop of the campground. And uh, I would say it's one of the volunteers up in there. It looks like they have some bench seating around the campground circle up there. Site 44 is the best site I've seen so far over here. It's not by the creek, but it's a large site. It's right next to the comfort station. Looks like the comfort station would have flush toilets. It's closed, so I can't go and check the shower out. But this is uh, Site 44. Where you park your vehicle you got your tent pad here and the comfort stations right over there there's another view of the comfort station and you also have a water spigot here okay so now we're we're going to take a walk through the uh the rv side the rv loop the campground here at otter creek got your dump station right here there you go campground host in here volunteer to say they're working on the campground what's closed there's your restroom facility looks like it would have running water flush toilets this is site a53 in the RV loop uh, so far I would say this campground Otter Creek Campground is not, is not big rig friendly. I haven't seen any sites that would accommodate my fifth wheel. Site A55, that's the road there. You could get a larger rig in A54 right here. I would fit in here. I really don't care for semicircles, and that semicircle is not flat. There's a grade to it. It's right across from where the comfort station is. That's a look back. You do have a grade right there. Here's another one of the larger sites that I've seen, A57, and it also has a pretty good pitch to it and then you got a drop off right off the asphalt here so even if you could put a fifth wheel in there or a long travel trailer right outside your door you're gonna have that drop off but uh, for a smaller camper that would be a good sight You got your picnic table in the creek. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, this is site 57. Site 57, it's a pull through, semi-circle. You can see the drop off there. And you have the creek right off in your backyard. Yeah, you can definitely tell this campground was not built for big rigs. This is A59, right next door to site A57. And uh, that's your campsite on the right side of that dotted white line. There's your picnic table down by the creek. Fire ring, but you have you could not put any slides out. So if you had like an Airstream with no slides, I guess you'd be okay there, depending on how long your rig was. Um, but there's no, there's nowhere to put your slide out because then you're gonna be hanging out in the, in the roadway. 
So this campground is an excellent example of uh, uh, why folks that have nimble camping configurations have much greater choices than uh, folks like myself with a 37 foot fifth wheel. Uh, this campground is definitely not big rig friendly, but if you have a, a nimble camping configuration, be a great campground for you especially if you have the access pass you can get in here or uh, uh, one of the other federal passes that'll give you a 50% discount and camp here for $10 a night Otter Creek Campground Blue Ridge Parkway Virginia if you like these videos like and subscribe and I'll see you down the road